Yeah, you don't park here and walk down. Uh-uh. <laughs> Drive close to the motherfucker. I'm not walking no mad blocks up out here. You don't even know anything about out here. <laughs> Are you dead ass? Hi all, we are headed to Philadelphia today. I told Mr. that I hadn't been to Philadelphia. Of all my years of being here, that's one of the places that I've never been. And so he just planned this road trip for us to go. And so we're gonna go. I was trying to go on TikTok to see like things, things to do in Philadelphia, but honestly, I, I'm not gonna be mad at all if it's just a road trip because it's brick outside and I wore this small puffer because I still want it to be cute. I do look cute and it is warm, but this is, we're in a cold weather. And I decided to just wear this little puffer, so we're here. I really had to get my Drake Essentials playlist together because just a Drake playlist in general, just to get me in the right mind frame because we can't be going so far and I'm gonna just be out here down bad. It's 12.52. And we're in Brooklyn, we're dropping something off and then we're gonna be headed towards the lease. I'll give you guys a little montage here and there or whatever. But for the most part, that is the plan, man. I haven't said anything to my sister because she just feels like, oh, content this and content that. Yes, I'm vlogging, but um, I'm vlogging. And she's gonna wanna tell me to go find something to do. But I don't think she understands the level of cold that we face here because she is in tropical climate, sweetie summer all year round and so she doesn't realize what it being brick outside literally means so um maybe we're not gonna say anything we're not sure but um yeah that's what's up I haven't been in the best mood since last night so I didn't even vlog when he was in here just now I'm just like whatever I'm not even in the mood but um the trip I guess is beginning to grow on me I suppose I'm just wearing this little wig that I've been had I just drew my brows in and like did a little bit of um what do you call that again i don't want it to be too dark i drew my brows in and i did a little bit of highlighter you guys can't even see because it's so bright outside but that's it and that's all and we're we're headed out so we'll see what happens So, um, we're in Philadelphia and it's a little weird. It's definitely not New York. Definitely not giving New York vibes either. And I feel like it's probably because it's my first. Oh my god. You know, I think it's crazy. Oh, so greasy. I think it's crazy how people always talk about, oh, New York this and New York that and the streets are so dirty and this and that and whatever. But this Philadelphia streets are dirty. <laughs> It's so crazy because every time people talk about New York, every time people visit New York, they're like, oh, it's mad garbage on the streets or whatever. Philadelphia is not clean. What is this? It's so, I don't know, it's so weird out here. So I watch this girl on YouTube who's from like, um, down here and every time she's saying she's going to the mall or whatever the case is, she's like, she drives to New Jersey and I'm like, so there's not a mall in Philly? But I guess sometimes too, you would know the malls better to know that, oh, this mall doesn't have much things or whatever. Just the same way how, you know, in the, <laughs> in the white neighborhoods, the malls will have better things and like the targets in those areas will have better things or whatever the case is. I guess it's easier to drive somewhere else because you, you have access to things that are a little bit better. But we're definitely in Philadelphia. This kind of reminds me of, um, of St. Albans a little bit in terms of no not exactly <laughs> not exactly like, this, this is like different Astoria. Astoria is very crammed up wow that's crazy they're maximizing the buildings for whatever they are what are they gonna do that's what they have to work with 
My, um, wow, the streets are so, this part kind of kind of reminds me of Brooklyn. But like everything looks, I don't know, it kind of looks like a movie, like it looks unreal. <laughs> like it's staged or something. And I caught like a good road trip where I'm able to like go somewhere else and see what, what it has to offer or whatever. Like I used to go to Connecticut like here and there. But um, it's just quite the adventure. We're gonna get um, we're gonna go get Philly cheesecake from Gino's. I really hope that that shit is slamming because to drive all the way down here to go get some Philly cheesecake that's not even busting like that would have been dumb tight. Yeah, it's the original. That's where it started. Okay, so we're gonna see because I feel like even when I buy Philly cheesecake in New York, like I'm looking, I only buy that like certain delis. Like some of the delis is like <laughs> they put their foot in there. It's so damn good. You know, and then other times you have it and it's not the same, but I'm a little weird, right? I'm a little bit weird. When I buy Philly cheesesteak, I don't want no onions, no peppers. Wow, it's, it's quite the adventure out here. Yeah, Anyways, the buildings are really nice for like photo ops, but like I'm not trying to take no pictures in front of nobody's home. Because like, what the hell? You know what I mean? Like that's a little weird to like be next to the people's homes taking pictures or whatever, but the buildings are like nice, so. I want to get like some nice pictures. What Philadelphia shows me is that, you know, in New York, like the buildings are very kind of on top of each other or whatever. You don't, it's not much space, but I haven't seen a standalone home just yet. And maybe because of the area that we are in, why it looks like this, but everything is on, like, it looks like everybody is on top of each other. Oh, it takes so long to like transition. It just looks like everybody is on top of each other. And we've been driving for a little minute. But um, I used to get outside of um, New York for once. And like I said, I love a good road trip. You know, I like going and experiencing something else or whatever. There, there isn't really much that I that we could do right now because one, it's brick outside. Literally, balls. I feel like my urine is frozen inside of me. <laughs> I don't know what the images that I had in my head of of um of <laughs> Philadelphia. I think what I'm always thinking is, oh, Meat Miller's from here. <laughs> you know the type of vibe that's gonna be. <laughs> You know, but um, it's very quiet. Uh -uh. <laughs> Drive close to the motherfucker. I'm not walking no mad blocks up out here. You don't even know anything about it out here. <laughs> Are you dead ass? You were so serious? Bruh, you don't even look like you can defend me. No. What? what this side looks like it's, it's more going on. You don't look a little alive people are eating and stuff it looks Gino's wow it's full yeah. Listen, I don't even know how much you guys can see if you guys are seeing my face, but this ain't that stay outside and eat it order. You hear me? It's brick outside. The type that your fingertips are like pink. So damn cold. How do I know which one is mine? All right, so I had a little cheesesteak or whatever, but like it wasn't slamming, honestly. It's a good thing we didn't specifically come here for that. Like we just came just cuz. And um, he said, let's just try the Philly cheesesteak since we're down here. But <clears throat> I could have really done without it. I could have really done without it. Like I could have gone my entire life just thinking that the cheesesteak in New York was all there was and that be it. But this one was not my favorite. And to each his own, you know, to other people it might taste like the best thing in the world. But I still would go to a deli in New York and buy some cheesesteak, honestly. And we got some Mountain Dew. One of my friends lived down here and I was um, texting her to see if she lived close by here, but <laughs> looks like it's far. So, and I haven't seen her in years and years. <clears throat> so that would have been nice since we're already down here. But, um, mm -mm, just 30 minutes from here, that's mad deep. But, um, yeah, like, it, it's not even a, let's go outside and stand by the building and take picture type of weather. Because when I tell you, as soon as you step outside, your fingertips are, are pink. You can't do that. We need to find um, a McDonald's so that 
Philadelphia City Hall was closed today. So that um, I could pee. Back from New Jersey, it was a good little trip. But, it's literally snowing outside. But I wanted to make sure that I took the trash out since we're just coming in. I'm like literally not gonna go back outside. I forgot a cardboard box. And so, I went and put it at the front door as if it was there the whole time. And he forgot it and he took the trash up and he's like, come on now. I know that I didn't leave this here. You just put it there. <laughs> anyways, he took it anyways. <laughs> but that's it for all the trash. So now I need to put the new bags back.